Jump shot. Save Doss. And he covers the ball still loose, though. Doyle gets a step. Fowler gets a piece. Still loose in the crease, picked up by Haas. And there's some coaches who don't look at that at all, let their players like that let it rip. And Matthias lets it rip and puts the Blue Devils on the board. As Matthias plays the pick, tough angle, and buries it. He has two. Quick slide coming. Kavanaugh feeds the crease. And Acello puts it in. So the Irish break through. Look at him look, just dust him with a shake, a long shot, and the hand looks fine there. Daly to the point. Look at how oh. big hit by Healy, no call. Unsettled opportunity to the doorstep, Matthias. All Duke right now. Perkovic gets some room, but Fowler win on the jump shot. He can't get it back for the putback. Change that up. And here's Hawes. No one's going to pick him up. He goes right down Broad Street and scores. Playing your best lacrosse in May. To me, this game is just more than an ACC semi-victory. Finally, win breaks through. And, and, and where do the Pioneers end up? And who's got up to make that brutal trip out west? And Matthias keeps on having another big day. Now Perkovic, lefty shot, and he puts it in the back of the net. It can kind of wake your team up. Absolutely. Because it forces guys to move. And they are awake now as Jack Near, a top 10 pick in Major League Lacrosse and an honorable mention All-American a year ago. Corrigan with his hands free and he scores. Gets it over to Cello, being guarded by Halls. A long shot and he scores. That may be a two-pointer when he plays for the Outlaws this summer, but it keeps the run going for the Irish. Under five minutes to play. Perkovic, lefty. The run continues. Slide ready. On the redodge. Underneath again, and he scores top shelf. So he'd rather five roll seconds the ball left on the shot clock. Gutterding with the slam dunk. What a pass, what a finish, that's the dagger.